Okay, hey guys, I am just here. I wanted to share me opening Valley of the Hidden Dinosaur. So, here's a video of me doing it. So, I just, of course, got to 15 and I got the quest from Elizabeth in Valdale, of course. Can I read that? Now it's really, now it really has been a while. Does the snow up on the mountain pass never melt? There's been a few unreasonably warm days lately, so maybe it's time to get up there and have a proper check. I know you're probably fed up watching snow melt, but I'm really, really keen to get into the Valley of the Hidden Dinosaur now. It's been a hundred years since people were last there, and a little bit of snow wouldn't be a lot to stop us. Okay. Let's go, let's go, let's go wrong way. <laughs> Yay! I basically stayed up all night and spent like I guess a majority of my star coins, probably like a thousand of my star coins just to get this unlocked, just to get leveled up to unlock this because I want a fjord so badly. Yes! The snow melted, a passage through the ice is exposed. Yay! Okay. Sorry about that. I want to go uh, do something real quick. Okay, so going back down to Elizabeth. I like this North Swedish, but in my opinion, I kind of like the darker one. A lot better, so I might get her out. Really, what wonderful news! I had a feeling it'd be fine. The days have been so sunny and warm lately. I just knew it would have an effect on the mountainside. How exciting! Now the Valley of the Hidden Dinosaur is open and waiting for us to explore. I really want to get my hands on some of the stuff that's been locked up in that valley for years. It's such a shame that the mountain pass has been so heavily blocked, otherwise we could have could have gone there years ago. Well, not years, ages ago. <laughs> oh well, now what are we waiting for? Ride out and look for a safe way to, go, to get through to the valley, then report back to me. Come on now, away you go, my friend. Here's a little tip. The valley is a very isolated and it might be tough to get out once you get in. Make sure you have some extra space in your uh, rucksack because there's not going to be any shops or stables in there. Yes ma'am. Yay! Yes, yes. I just took a picture. I just took a picture. Whoa. Yes. I'm so happy. Finally in the valley. Hello, structure. The elevator hasn't been used in a hundred years. It's not fit for us. A frozen valley thick with freezing mist spreads out beneath the old elevator tower. Welcome to the Valley of the Hidden Dinosaur. Thank you. No elevator, but it really looks as though it's possible to get down along the mountainside here. The ice platforms along the mountainside don't look as though they'd hold up any hold up very long if you step on them. I need to get down without stopping. Then I won't be able to come back up the same way. 
This feels so risky, but I gotta do it what you gotta do what you gotta do in the name of the adventure. I totally just, just uh I hope I can find another way up later until then I'm alone and have nobody to help me. <laughs> Alright. Now, this is going to be a little harder for me because I have, oh, that. I have laggage. Maybe it's best to go a little slow. Oh. Or not. <laughs> I've been here before. Just this is my own account, so it's a little different. In my opinion. Slow down. <laughs> I did not slow down enough. Whew. Slow down. Oh, poor Tinker. No, 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 Tinker. It's not a Tinker. It's North Swedish. Damn it. Why won't you go? <laughs> Such fail, failage. I'm not cutting any of this out because I think it's hilarious. I'm such a noob. I am such a noob. Maybe it's best I go slow, but I don't know. Oh, crap. I can just get down off this. Thank you. Okay, that's done. Thank God. Over here. The elevator lower section. You're alone here now. Nobody can help you. This is the lower part of the elevator. How the elevator tower seems as unusable from down here as it is from up there. The motor is right there in the middle of the elevator structures to lower section. I can check it out and see if it's possible to fix it. If I can fix this elevator, then I've got a sure way back to Valadale and Elizabeth can come with me into the valley of the hidden dinosaur without risking death on the dangerous mountainside. Okay. <laughs> Examining. I didn't mean to do that. Oh well. That building over there must be smoking in, smoking, smoking, some kind of control room. I need to check it out. Note, again, I stayed up all night trying to do this. It's so worth it in my opinion. Do I need to get down? No, okay, good. I think I do have to get down when I go in there, though. I wonder if there's a key hidden around here somewhere, around the floor frame or under a window maybe? Maybe the old classic upturned flower pot? <laughs> upturned. Upturned. It's worth a look. I really want to get into this little building. Well, of course you'll look there first. Over here? Yes? No? Yes? No? No? Okay. Uh... I'm 
gonna go check back here. No, come on. <laughs> I bet it's in here. I bet it's in this right here. I swear to God, if it's over there, I'm gonna be so mad. Oh, thank God. Yes, the key fit the lock. The doors. Oh, that's um, a little error there. Ow, the door hit me in the face. This is the control room for the elevator. That control panel looks so old. Looks to be built using the most groundbreaking energy from the late 19th century. Definitely needs a closer look to see how messed up the control panel is. Examining it's so tall. Why'd they make it so tall? The control panel looks pretty intact, even though it's not been used for a hundred years. The building seems to have protected all the delicate machinery from the wind and weather. If I can find things around here that could be used as spare parts. I think I can usually actually fix this motor. If I can find usable fuel, then I can get the elevator started. I really feel like I need to find a safe way to travel between Valdale and this amazingly exciting valley. Only then can Elizabeth come here with me. While I was looking for the key, I noticed a few odds and ends poking up through the snow. There could be things lying all over the place that could be used as spare parts. I can't be sure, but I also think I might have seen a diesel canister here somewhere in the snow. Oh, really? I'm just gonna run. Thank you. Almost done. This tank is filled with hundred year old diesel. There's got to be a can or container of some kind around here somewhere under the snow that I can um Okay, I'm gonna see... Oh, over here? What's this? Well, that's for the... Okay. Over here! Yay! They reach that. It's so tall. <laughs> I 
The fuel tank is now filled with loads of really old diesel. Good. Okay, now. Up here. Seem to be a bit of ragtag bunch of spare parts, mostly junk. I guess some of it could be used for a basic repair, though. I'm totally sure the motor can be fixed even with these random bits of rubbish. I saw a toolbox in the control room someplace. I'll need that when I'm doing my repairs. Get that toolbox, get that toolbox, get that toolbox. Get the toolbox. I ran into a fence. I got the toolbox. I wish we can jump. It'd be so nice if we can jump ourselves. But I guess it makes sense in a way. Toolbox. And this goes here. An old tray of food. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> What's this? <laughs> Oh, pipes can be built as a fuel line. Filter needs cleaning. Okay. Yay. So, done. The motor is fixed, I think. For now, at least. Now, to try and start any other videos, control panel. Okay. Mega Whopper! Three times a charm! Yay! <laughs> the old elevator started up. Yay, it works! For how long, though? That's the question. Probably not entirely without risk to ride it. Yay! Come on! I think I need you now. Do, 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 do. I'm gonna read that. I need to give the elevator a test run. Come on, Mega Walker, let's go. We can't stand around here all day. Or maybe we can. Whoa. Let's go! I like taking pictures. Yes, I do. Mm -hmm. We did it, Mega Walker! We did it! This ride in the elevator didn't exactly feel safe, but we made it in one piece. We were lucky. <sighs> Mega Walker, we should stay hopeful that it lasts long enough to give us a few more lifts up and down. Now thank goodness we can move pretty f freely between Valadeo and the valley. Whoop whoop! 